Hey guys, Cast72 here. I have another product I want to share with you guys. So the last video I made before this one comes out will be the table that I made. Um, just a simple product table, which is what this is here now. This is actually the table. Um, all I did to it was I basically put some uh, vinyl on top. But what I want to talk about today, guys, is this product called, uh, it's made by Nice Vidi. Um, it's a video light kit. And the reason I wanna talk about it is because I bought it for the purpose of this table and demonstrating products such as I'm about to do right now for you guys. Um, I'll try to do this as quick as possible because right now I have one of the lights that I'm actually testing right now on this video, but it's connected to my power uh, pack and it doesn't have too much power, so I gotta make this short and sweet. Um, so it's made by um, video, I'm sorry, Nice Viddy and they call it the video light kit. And what it consists of is two tripods. I can't show you the other one because I'm using it now as well as the, the LED light. But it basically comes with a tripod, as you can see here, and you can lock it. And it extends uh, three different uh, extensions for a total of, and I measured it about five, feet 11 inches at its full length with the let me put this here real quick with the led which is this right here i believe these leds are about um, 10 inches um the color temperature is 2800k to 6500k the power is 15 watts and the luminosity is 1700 lm um the model is an NV-L12, in case you're interested. I'll put the link in the description either way. Um, and this is the LED. Uh, it comes with two cell phone holders, which basically wrap around the pole. Um, it won't wrap around the bottom portion of it because this is the thicker pole, but if you extend it out, it'll wrap around the the actual, this would be the first, second, it'll wrap around the third and fourth pole. And then of course your light, there's a screw here that the light can either be mounted uh, horizontally, basically would screw it in that way, or you can mount it vertically that way. And um, I know I'm a little far from the camera, but there's a little, if you want to call it a little wing, wing nut screw right there that you basically would twist. And that's how you can actually twist, turn the screw to lock the, the LED light on there. Um, it comes with two USB to type C adapters in case you want to get a longer USB to USB cable. And the reason for that is in case these cables are not long. By the way, the cable that runs from this light to its power source via USB is only five meters. Um, the other thing I'd like to mention is it comes with a bag, little stowaway bag. And then of course it comes with some minimal instructions. There's not a lot to it. You know, it just shows you how to extend uh, the tripods, where to mount the cell phone bracket and how in two different ways that you can mount the light. Um, what I'd like to do real quick is I'm going to approach the one that I have connected now because I want to show you the controls that it has. I know I'm a little far away from the camera. I'll get here a little bit closer in just a second, but basically what you have is you have a small little controller that's on the actual wiring that leads to its power source. And what you have is you have your power on, um, you have three different light settings, which I'm gonna demonstrate here for you in a minute. And then you have your um, low light and high light uh, range. And then again, like I mentioned, your power off button. Let me get over here real quick and I can show you the differences. We'll use this box as demonstration. And just give me a second. Like I said, I'm trying to do this before the uh, power pack runs out. Um, 
So here's what it looks like. Let's see if I can focus on that for you guys. And as you can see, you have, again, at the bottoms, your low light, your on and off, your change of the light um, uh, color sequence, and then your high. So basically what I mean by high is it's at its fullest now. If we reduce that, you'll see it starts drop. Let me get back to the box. There you go. And it'll start dropping down. That's completely off. And then again, so you've got, let's see, you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine light settings. And then of course you can change the color of the warmth of the light. So right now I have it on pure white, or actually this is blue, um, incandescent light and blue again. And um, other than that, that's all the controller does for you. Basically, again, this is the to change the, seek color, uh, the color sequence of the light. And then again, the brightness. And then how low you want the light. Other than that, guys, that's pretty much it. Um, like I said, it's it extends to about five feet. Um, I measured it, it's about five feet, 11 inches tall. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I wanted to share that with you guys because um, I needed some better lighting inside my, my office here. It's um, this kind of light here didn't do so well with two tripods and the brightness of these lights, I can actually control some better light um, lighting for my videos. Now, I, I right now the lighting is not exactly the way I'd like it because I don't have the other tripod to the left of me. And the reason for that is because I needed it to at least show you guys the demonstration. Um, so yeah, just a real quick video. I just wanted to show you guys in case you're all interested, you're looking for a good light source um, to present your videos, whether it's if you're doing a presentation or if you're uh, doing product reviews, I just thought I'd want to share that with you guys in case you weren't aware. Um, the price wasn't too expensive. Like I said, I'll put the link in the description. I don't remember off the top of my head. Um, and aside from that, guys, um, that's about it. I just wanted to share that with you. This is Cast 72 Have a good one. See you on the next one.